In this video, we're going to review the parts of the microscope and the functions of those parts. First here we have the base, then we have the arm, we then have the head or the body tube, here we have the ocular lens, here we have the objective lenses. In order to get the total magnification of an object, you take the ocular lens magnification and multiply it by the magnification of the specific objective lens that you are using. Here we have the stage, which you put the slide on. Here we have the mechanical stage, which you'll see better in the next picture, which allows you to move the slide on the stage. Here you have the course adjustment, or the course focus knob, which is the larger of the two knobs. It allows you to make major changes in how close the objective lens is to the slide, and again, would help you make uh, better changes in getting it focused. You only want to use this course focus knob when you're on the lowest objective. If you use it on a higher objective, you can run the objective lens into the slide and cause damage to both the slide and the objective lens. This is the fine focus knob. You make small changes in the focusing of the object. This is the one you use to fine-tune your focusing on the lowest objective lens, but then you can also use it on the higher objective lenses to make sure that you get the best focus that you can. Here we have the condenser. The condenser is going to focus the light, and here we have the substage light, which obviously is the light source that's going to travel through here, through here so you can see what's on the slide. The last structure on here is the iris diaphragm, and that controls, that controls how much of this light gets through so you can see the slide. What you'll find as you go up higher and higher objectives, that less and less light gets through, and so you're going to have to modify the amount of light that comes through to be able to see the slide, and you do that with the iris diaphragm. On this next page, you see some of the same structures. Here are your ocular lenses. Here are your objective lenses. Here you see the stage. Here, this metal, silver, is the mechanical stage. Here are the knobs you use to move the mechanical stage so you can adjust where the slide is located. Here is the knob for the iris diaphragm, which again controls the amount of light getting through. Here's your substage light. Here is your condenser. And again, here you have the base of the microscope. So again, review these parts. There's a practice quiz that you can take, and there's also a worksheet that you can fill out showing that you can identify the parts of the microscope and also make sure that you're familiar with the functions of those parts.